Hello YouTubers, Alaska Prepper here. Well, I just wanted to do a real quick video. Uh, came across a really good deal and it became a prepping opportunity, so I took it. I thought I'd let you guys know about it. So I was at the supermarket here not too long ago and they had these guys right here on sale. They were $1.49 a piece, which is a really good deal to begin with for a box of uh, this cereal right here. Um, the reason I decided to go with this cereal right here is because it's very, very low in fat. I think it's like less than a half of a gram of fat per serving. So since it's got such little fat and it's already really dry, there's almost no moisture in there whatsoever. Uh, I'm assuming that it's going to be able to store for a long time if properly stored. So what I did was is I bought nine boxes of these at $1.49 a box, but I also got a coupon for $2 off of every three boxes. So I ended up paying $7.41 for nine boxes of this cereal right here. And those nine boxes was enough to fill up this whole container, this five gallon bucket. As you can see, I've already got it in a Mylar bag. I'm getting ready to uh, put some oxygen absorbers in there and seal it up with an iron. So I'm not going to take you guys through that. I've already put out a video on how to do that. You guys can check that out if you want to see how I seal it with an iron. It's really easy. But I just want to show you guys that whenever you come across an opportunity, there's nothing wrong with taking it. I ended up getting almost 12,000 calories for $7.41. So if you add the... Uh, Mylar bag, the bucket, and the oxygen absorber in there, you're probably looking at about 12 bucks for 12,000 calories, roughly. All right, so that's not too bad. A uh, 1,000 calories per dollar, that's pretty darn good. A 1,000 calories of nutrition per dollar. And as you can see here, with time, some of the nutrients, depending on how long you store it, well, you won't be able to see it. But with time, depending on how long you store it, some of the nutrients may go away. But this already comes with... Vitamin A, vitamin C, calcium, iron, vitamin D, thiamine, uh, roboflavin, niacin, vitamin B6, folic acid, vitamin B12, phosphorus, magnesium, zinc. And like I said, it's got about, oh, I'm sorry, it's got 1.5 grams of uh, fat uh, per serving. So I still don't consider that to be very much. So I'm pretty confident that this will store pretty well for a long time, uh, especially having put some, uh, ox having put some oxygen absorbers in there. And it's got a lot of fiber too. It's got, um, uh, dietary fiber. Let's see, two grams, which is not bad really when you think about it. Uh, usually 25 grams a day is uh, what sh you should be taking in for fiber. So when you combine this with the other foods you eat, should be okay. Uh, it's got two grams of protein per serving. This is not the most nutritious food in the world, but if you don't have cereal, uh, I guess it would be kind of a kind of a sweet because this cereal is kind of sweet. And if you haven't had cereal for a long time, everybody likes to have a little bit of cereal now and then. I personally don't eat it all the time, but every once in a while I have some. So I just wanted to show you that. Something else I wanted to show you. Remember the video that I did uh, with storing stuff in the plastic bottles and the two liter uh, containers or the two liter soda bottles? And I told you that after you put the oxygen absorber in there, that after a few days, you'll see it collapse because there's negative pressure in there. So it's kind of like a suction. So if you guys can see that, you can see the rice. You can see how it's indented. That's because the oxygen absorber is doing its job. So you know that these two liters, you know that they are sealed because there's negative pressure in that bottle and you can see it by the suction of the bottle. All right, guys. Well, that was it. This is going to be a short one. Like I said, I just wanted to show you uh, this uh, minor prepping opportunity that I came across. So I went ahead and took it and I think it's a pretty good investment, you know, uh, $12 roughly for 12,000 calories. And if you just want to count what the food costs, it was only $7.41. So that's going to be it. This will be a short video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, remember, be good to each other. When good people do good things, good things happen. And
Oh, I almost I lost my train of thought. <laughs> Sorry about that. And remember to reach one, teach one, and repeat. If everybody did that, ladies and gentlemen, this would be a better world. Okay? Uh, many blessings to all of you and to all of your families. This is Alaska Prepper. I'm out.